Monday morning. First day on a new track, right here, kind of in the same area we've been in. Just going from farm to farm. Dad's on one side of this little branch and I'm on the other. This is, uh, the fence is right up here. So we're just gonna start in this area and work our way all the way down to the next fence. And of course from the next fence on below is where we've already cut. There should be about 75 or 80 trees on this job. Decent trees, uh, mainly lumber here. There's no real big high dollar trees on this job. Dad's yeah, getting ready to clip that one. And down she goes. I better get started or he's going to leave me in the dirt. Massy day to be cutting. Got trees laying everywhere. I'm going to jump over here to the other side of the creek and push down towards dad. I know them old cows, they're starving to death. They're eating these leaves off these walnut trees. What few leaves are on them still. About as quick as they hit the ground. Falls in full swing here in southwest Missouri. I could not be happier about it. Other than it's a little, a little cool today and drizzly. I don't mind the cool weather, but I could do without the, without the drizzle. Kind of makes for a miserable day. Dad's been knocking some pretty good trees down. It's dry here. We had about an inch of rain in Stockton yesterday. They didn't get hardly anything over here. But it's dry. We need a little rain to settle the dust anyway. Done cutting for today. I think Dad and I cut 65 this morning. Benny came over to work on the 548. He's uh, trying to work out some bugs with it right now. Of course, he's dragging logs to work the bugs out. It's always little things. The little things add up and they just become an aggravation. And I can't stand things not being right on equipment. He needs to get his load up. Sorry, that was so shaky. I had to climb the skitter. Still got his load down. Gotta keep the logs up when you're dragging. Pull that up a bit where we can cut it off and push it in these piles. There he goes. Now this uh, area right here, when I looked at this timber, they'd had a like a tree saw in here for a skid steer. And they'd cut a bunch of this hedge and locust. And I'd made up my mind when I was walking through here, I was gonna pile that stuff up. And you can see up through there, those brush piles, that's just what I did. A lot of the walnut tops like this here, we weren't asked to do any kind of pilot on this, but generally when it's open areas like this or fairly open, I try to kind of push them up or pile them the best I can because I know they're running cattle in here and they need all that pasture they can get. So we'll get this guy worked up. We'll swing this top back around to that pile there. Up he goes. Then we'll try to grab a couple of these here. Dad, he slayed the trees on this side of the creek this morning. He said we had a really good morning, Dad and I did cutting. And 
Now to give you some idea what's wrong with that 548, for some reason the hydraulic speed is not where I want it to be. Of course we've done all the obvious stuff, started with fluid then checked filters and replaced filters, but we're still not getting the speed that I like to see on that machine. So that's what Benny's here working on it for. And like I said, he's he's dragging logs, but each time he drags, he, he tinkers with something. That's all the further I'm going to go over. <laughs> Hedge trees kind of poking me. Well, that's, uh, we got two more right here. Both of them are, uh, I don't know why this one didn't get cut off unless it fell down later, but... I'm going to cut this off, then I'll drag that one down up there, then head to the deck and we'll move on down the creek.
guys, if you like what you see, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel for all of our latest videos.